morning, everybody. Okay, I just woke up. I know, I look rough. That's because I was some crying last night, so my eyes are really puffy. So we're gonna depuff these real quick. But everyone lately has been asking me, and I'm not just saying that as an annoying influencer. I actually been getting questions. What do I eat in a day? So I'm filming everything that I ate today for you guys. Oh, this is cold. So yeah, join along for my little food eating vlog. Hope you guys enjoy this video. There's a lot of water in my eyes right now. I apologize. It's a rough morning today. It's fine. It's supposed to be a pretty day today. There's a few clouds in the sky. I'm gonna go work out today and hang out with friends. It's about the only plans I have. It's Saturday. This video is probably gonna get posted on, I don't know what day. I guess we'll just kind of see. But Welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys enjoy this video. Be sure to give this video a like. This is way too much energy for right whenever I wake up. Hit that subscribe button. Turn on all your video notifications. But I'm hungry, so we're gonna start cooking. <laughs> First step in the morning, I eat my vitamin C immunity gummies. Cause honestly, sometimes I just crave a little something sweet. I don't know if I actually even do anything. It says it supports the immune system. Packed with vitamin C and D. Elderberry antioxidants. Ooh. Yeah, I don't think they do anything, but mental thing. All the ingredients for my little breakfast. We got some eggs and cheese, you know, omelet, fruit, and then some turkey sausage. Didn't know how amazing this stuff was. I really like this. And I like how it has like everything already in it. Fruit cut and washed. Pan sprayed. Gotta shake the eggs. And we're gonna let this get a little hot. And then we're gonna put the eggs, you know, boop. I've also discovered I am absolutely terrible at making omelets. Um, usually turns out into a last minute scrambled eggs. So we will attempt an omelet for you guys today because we're feeling fancy. Even though look at how bad my nails are right now. I have not had time to get the redone and these two will not rip off I'm like trying to rip them off with all my might and I think my entire nail might come off if I succeed she's a little toasty Boop. Look at those chunks in there. Those are the poppers that we were talking about. There we go. Mmm. Uh, guys, wait, let me turn on the ambient lighting. Um, it's time to flip. For some reason, there's lots of bubbles in this thing. Ugh. This is the pressure that I'm not built for. Like, if this was in a hospital and saving a life, I could freaking do this. But making an omelet, I cannot do this. I think this is the main issue, though. I need an actual spatula. This is just gonna end bad. I mean, it's not stuck to the pan though so that's an improvement <laughs> mm. if you guys had high hopes for this I am sorry to disappoint you <laughs> I just want her to be pretty <sighs> Plan number two, we're gonna put it onto this plate and see if we can just flip it into the pan. Oh, it ripped! Ah, boom. <gasps> okay, this is gonna be eggs. We just really gave up on that. Darn it, I really wanted a pretty omelet. Okay, that's just not happening today, I guess. Well, the eggs are almost done cooking. Darn it. I'm gonna put in my two sausage patties. Boop, boop, darn it. I'm a failure. Can't even make an omelet. Oh well, we're gonna plate her like a real queen does though. Cause if I can't make an omelet, I wish she's gonna be pretty. Sometimes I wish I had three hands, you know? Ah, the graceful Gabrielle. I'm a mess and it's actually not even that early in the morning, it's 10. I woke up and laid in bed and watched TikTok for a while. I need to do better. It's a Saturday though and I was I made two YouTube videos yesterday, so. It was okay for me to lay in bed. Also, I did not sleep last night, which I'll tell you about that in a little bit. Why I also woke up crying. Breakfast is served right in front of my beautiful windows. If you can't tell, I do not count calories. I don't really care about that. I just eat as much as I think I can because I am trying to gain weight right now. Slash muscle. Because if you're working out a ton and you're not eating enough calories, you're just gonna get really skinny, which that happened to me. I wasn't filming like YouTube vlogs and stuff, but I accidentally lost about 12 pounds at one point last month and I was looking extremely skinny. My butt was gone. You could literally see all my ribs, but it was just because I was working out so, so much. So now I'm trying to eat a ton because I don't want that to happen again. Here we go. Yum, yum, yum. Also, <laughs> you want to eat what you like. Who cares if it's a little bit unhealthy? I know this cheese is not the most healthy thing ever, but like, I don't care. You only live life once. Oh, it's processed. Okay, so I could have had bacon today. I just felt like sausage, but like some people were like, ew, don't eat bacon. It's not healthy. Nah, I really don't care. So more of the story. Eat what makes you happy. I don't know what I'm having for lunch yet. I guess we'll figure that one out as we get to that point. But also, I'll just tell you guys now what the heck is going on in my personal life. So my grandpa was hospitalized. That's why 
I was crying earlier. They don't know exactly what happened to him. They did a brain scan and it showed that he did previously have a stroke. He was having stroke-like symptoms. They did give him the medicine though that gets rid of any blockages. So that was good. They don't know if he had like a reaction to medication because half his body went numb and then his heart rate was dropping to 40. So then he's previously had open heart surgery. And so they thought they were gonna have to put in a pacemaker. Right now they're just doing a ton of tests. It's just been stressful and I felt really bad because my mom, the night before called me and I didn't answer because I was with one of my best friends Brooke she's been some of these videos and she was like call me that's all she said she was like call me later and I totally forgot to call her when I got home I got home at like 10 30 it just like passed my mind sorry it is extremely windy outside I don't know if you guys can hear that my seat cushion's about to blow away and then the next morning I was driving into my workout and my mom sends in our family group chat a picture of my grandpa in the hospital and I had no idea at that point that he was in the hospital so that's kind of how I was told that he was hospitalized and so I was calling my my mom she wasn't answering I called her like three times nothing and then I called my dad and he was like yeah your mom didn't tell you and it happened the night before and that's what she was trying to call me and tell me about but I had no idea because she didn't make it sound like it was that important because my mom and dad randomly will call me all the time some some prayers and good vibes because they're definitely needed they're appreciated but yeah I'm gonna eat this breakfast and my phone is blowing up right now so I need to see what's going on I'll talk to you guys later Okay, it's a few, an hour and a half later. Um, I'm eating some animal cookies. I'm about to go work out. Usually I take pre-workout, but I'm all out. So animal cookies it is. And don't hate on me, the best choice ones, they taste the best. I don't know what it is usually. Their cheese, it's messed up. Don't even try them. But they're animal cookies, 10 out of 10. I need to go work out and I'm procrastinating. I got distracted, started making TikToks. So if you don't follow me on TikTok or Insta, go check it out, at Gabrielle underscore Moses. Mm -mm -mm. I love animal cookies. They're so cute. Oh, they're not that bad. Seven grams of sugar. Lemonade is bad. The other day I was craving lemonade and I was looking at the nutrition facts. Don't ever read nutrition facts. <laughs> it had like 42 grams of sugar in like a little bottle. I was like, oh, still drink it. <laughs> I'll see you after my workout. It's lunchtime. I destroyed my arms. You might not be able to tell because they look a little bit like noodles, like chicken arms, like toothpicks, you know, anything like that. I know I'm working on it. It's just not in my jeans to have big arms, let's just say. But lunch. We got some potatoes. We have a lot of pulled pork because we're trying to get that protein in. And then some Brussels sprouts. And no, I didn't cook this. This was um, my meal prep. So that's why you guys didn't get like a 10 minute intro. Of, oh, I'm making some pork. I also have some barbecue sauce. And this is all based on like my macros and whatnot. I'm getting a minimum of 45 grams of protein, 12 grams of fat per meal, 42 grams of protein per meal, 35 grams a carb per meal. That's just for my two meal prep meals that I do a day. And then as you can see, I don't pay attention. This is just because my trainer. If it wasn't up to me, I'd be eating a Subway sandwich right now. But let's be honest, this is a little bit more healthy. So I'm gonna heat this up and eat it. I forgot to say I'm drinking some sparkling water, strawberry and cucumber flavored. It's an aha. <laughs> and I'm also adding more sauce because this is not gonna be enough barbecue sauce for all that meat. So we have some Magnificent sauce from Trader Joe's that I'm gonna eat with the potatoes. Yum. Um, so I was gonna be healthy and eat a quinoa bowl for dinner. <laughs> that didn't end up happening. I took a shower, we're all clean now. And Postmates was just calling my name. I just was craving some hibachi. So we're not healthy over here. I'm not gonna lie to you guys either. I could have been healthy. Could have said I was eating a quinoa bowl, but that's just not how we do it here. And um, anyways, my DoorDash got Postmates, whatever. And I realized I might have ordered too much, but I guess this is just gonna be a nice midnight snack too. So <laughs> this is what we got. Oh my gosh, do you guys hear those sirens? Those are bad. Um, So a little show of everything that I got. I'm watching a World War II movie right now. Oh, my fried rice. Yum, yum, yum. Also, what is up with this yum, yum sauce? It is, this is, looks like it's gonna be spicy. We got some miso soup. <laughs> um, they gave me three of these too. And another yum, yum sauce with some salad noodles, which it's weird. Up here in Kansas City, they charge extra for noodles. You have to add it as a side. I don't like that. And then I got shrimp hibachi and chicken. And then there's some veggies. I'm gonna finish watching my movie, drink my miso soup first, and then, and then I have a midnight snack. <laughs> 
that was the biggest disappointment in hibachi I've ever had. Made me a little bit sad, not gonna lie. The noodles taste like dirty noodle water. I don't even know. They tasted kind of fishy, which just kind of, they smelled bad. Honestly, I didn't eat them and I feel really bad for wasting them. I think I may have puked if I tried eating all of them. <laughs> I'm a smell person and if my food doesn't smell good, then I try and taste it. It tasted how it smelled, but that's that. In a little bit, I'm probably gonna have dessert. I don't know, we'll see how I'm feeling, but I'm gonna go read, so. Okay, I'm gonna go hang out with some friends and drink some wine. Yes, I am 22 now guys. I can legally do this. So peace out guys Hope you guys enjoyed this video of what I eat in a day brutally honest edition. Hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one